the goal of today's video was supposed to be ending up at the campfire, right? Uh, nope, we ended up at Dave's Hot Chicken. <laughs> Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, your boy's a little late, but it's all good because you know why? I actually don't know why. I have no reason why, I'm just running a little late, but it's all good. I'll survive. It's, it's okay. This is a fantastic angle. Tend to work now. Just gonna have a normal day today. But it's pretty humid out here. What the hell? You can see the weather. The weather's not too good. But it could be worse. It's very gloomy, but I think it's gonna I think it's gonna clear up by this afternoon if I'm correct. Actually, hey, you know what? This weekend's actually not gonna be too bad. I was uh let's do a quick little Alduin forecast here. So um this weekend here in the great state of North Dakota, it was actually supposed to be around like 70s, like 70, 75, give or take. And now it matches out at 81 next week is actually supposed to be around the 80s so hey man the, the great forecast coming up here i don't know what i'm gonna be doing but i'll figure something out yeah good morning um running a little bit late i woke up so if you guys watched yesterday's video you guys would understand what happened i woke up a little bit late i had to make a quick little mukbang video for you guys and now i'm, I'm running about seven minutes behind schedule here but it's all good mistakes happen in the aldwin headquarters but you know that's that's usually that's not really uncommon all right before i keep yapping here and bore you guys to death i'm just gonna let's let's just let, let's head to work yeah <laughs> i need a golden retriever all right someone please donate a golden retriever to me all right i'll take care of everything else as long as you purchase the dog for me i can assure you the dog will be a-okay i just want a golden retriever i don't know if i oh Oh, whoop, oh, what the heck? Whoopie. Flip again. You're not gonna show off? Alright. No, but as I was... Alright. Alright, there was a customer, my bad. But I talk about it all the time that I... Uh, the two types of breeds that I want. A Corgi and a Retriever. Yeah, you could probably imagine that if... Uh, in, if any case that the, the parents of Ruby decide to let go of Ruby, I'd be the first one to take her. 100%. She is so adorable, bro. Especially, like, good demeanor dogs like these. Like, of course, there's different kinds of Retrievers. There's, like, the, the really mellow ones, which I like. Semi-hyper ones, but, like, just ultra-friendly. And there's some... Some Retrievers are a little bit on the aggressive side but um those are rare to find anyway i'd take this one all right just very like come on ruby 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 very loving you know what i mean i'm a fan i'm a fan someone please give me a retriever all right all right ruby you should get picked up soon all right All right, ladies and gentlemen, first off, I got good news and well, positive talk and negative talk, I guess. One positive talk, it is completely clear. The sun is out, no clouds. Well, there's a little bit, but point is it's, you know, 99% sunny. Here's a quick little negative talk I just wanted to bring up. I don't want to sound like a stupid little fear monger or whatever, but like, it's going to sound like it. It's nice that the sun is still completely out, right? Uh, and it's 6.30. But for some reason, I'm getting like the 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 winter sunset vibe you know what i mean this feels like winter for some reason i don't know what it is the or not the aura but like the, the feel and i know that fall is coming here really soon but it just it just feels like it right now i guess it's kind of appropriate because you know it's about to be september but already like i we already blew through summer like that that's that's insane it's kind of like i don't go to school but like i see people already going to school and stuff like my high school's back in action again and like I've, to me i'm just kind of like damn it is what it is though actually here's what i want to do first really quickly i want to go to rock 30 really quickly rock 30 is where i got the ds and like the the funkos and stuff so i want to go there really quickly to see if they have a stylus all right if they have a stylus like at all i'd love to take one of those all right like a ds stylus let me let me let 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 i can't speak all right let me go inquire real quick all right three two one hey 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 hey, hey. yeah perfect six dollars this is for the 3ds and also for dsi and this was apparently the last one i'll take it i will take it yes i will and i did take it six dollars and 99 cents this is perfect man i might need to get another charger though just a second charger for my dsi look at this, look at this. and wait hold on hold on hold on let me just extend this fully like this. Wait, how does it go in? Bang! Bang! That's money! That's cash! It's low-key kind of loose, though. I'm not gonna lie, but it's all good. We got three more just in case I rage at Mario or some shit. This is a W all around. All right, I'm gonna go home real quick. 
I don't even know if that was English. I'm gonna go home real quick to the old apartment and then uh, we'll kind of go from there. I don't really know what to do exactly yet. Oh, actually, the goal of today's video, well, um, let me go home first and then I'll talk about it, right? The main goal of this video is to get everything done that I need to get done. The main thing is the editing. Um, I want to try to get a double upload for you guys by the time you guys see this video. So, so spoiler alert, if uh, if you see on my channel right now, if there's two uploads, then I, then I completed it. But the goal is to get the video done, get that all edited for you guys, and then uh, at the end of the night, uh, campfire. That's, that's the goal. Uh, <clears throat> got everything taken care of now. I uh, just had to fold laundry. You know what I'm saying? Some responsibility shit. But now we're gonna head to, head to the old gym here. But I want to try something new. Instead of scrolling, through like whatever like, like on, on like youtube or something like in between sets and stuff instead of doing that i want to whip out the ds <laughs> and for those of you that are master predictors master pre master yeah i don't know but for those of you that are like good at predicting stuff i guess yes there will be a video coming up eventually about i'm addicted to my nintendo ds yeah eventually that that'll probably come eventually so push day push day Guys, just got done with the lift. The problem is, I don't have anything to eat. Just one of those things where like, you know, it, it, it's a good thing that we got the lift done. Got a huge pump, very nice pump. I just don't have anything to eat. Big bag, big. Uh, yeah. Guys, I'm sorry. All right, this is change of plans. The goal of today's video was supposed to be um, ending up at the campfire, right? Uh, nope, we ended up at Dave's Hot Chicken. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, alright? This place has been open for about th almost three weeks, and I think I've gotten Dave's Hot Chicken, I think, like, seven times or something like that. Almost ten times, I don't know, and I'm... I don't know what to say, man. I'm, but the thing is, though, can you blame me? For those of you that really like Dave's Hot Chicken, can you really blame me? This is one of the better chicken places I've ever been to, all right? Period. I don't know if it's like one of those, it's, it's just a phase, mom. It's just a phase, mom. I don't know if it is just a phase or it's a serious addiction, but you know what? For now, we'll have to call it an addiction. Oh, I can't. We'll have to call it an addiction. And I'm sorry. It's just gonna be the way it is. There's something, they put some form of crack into Dave's sauce or something. I don't, I don't even know. Like... Yeah, that's good. The chicken, the whole appeal for me, in the beginning, in the beginning, in the, in the beginning, the appeal of Dave's Hot Chicken for me was the Reaper. The first time I had Dave's Hot Chicken was, um, I think the beginning of this year when I, like I said, I had the, uh, the Reaper, right? It turned into something that I just started to like, right? The time after that, uh, when I had Dave's Hot Chicken was, uh, at the WWE event or during the WWE, not, I don't, you get what I mean. And I got the Reaper. The next time I just decided, you know what? Why don't we enjoy Dave's Hot Chicken? And then all of a sudden, Dave's Hot Chicken decided to open at my town. And three weeks later, here we are, mac and cheese. Like I said, man, I think they have one of the better um, mac and cheese. I've been following these guys for a while. I think I mentioned that before. The cool thing about this, right? It's kind of like a, it's a little bit surreal. Not surreal, it's not that deep. I've been following these guys for a while now. I remember when one of my friends put me on this and I thought, oh my God, I need to have some. He told me it was only in California and I'm like, well, shit, it is what it is. I looked at their post. It's like one of those like stands or whatever, like a Dave's Hot Chicken stand. Here it is, this is the image that I saw. This is one of the posts that I saw. I thought, oh my God, I would actually go to California for this. One of the things that I, I was like, you know what? I'd love to go to California for Dave's Hot Chicken on top of like the, the in and out and stuff. But then time went by, it, ex it started expanding and um, you know, like I I said here we are now right here i've been an og fan of these guys and i don't think these guys have ever really disappointed i don't know if there's any controversies with these guys like i think they've always been like on top of it the only controversy i guess was uh mr champagne poppy himself drake decided to uh support these guys and now it's a little bit tainted but it's all good I mean, without further ado let's just have some of the chicken Hold on listen to the crunch this is just delicious got the medium heat Yes, sir. Now, a cool little experiment would be if I went to Raisin Cane's and got like a like a cup of their sauce, came back home, and then had some Dave's Hot Chicken with it. I think that would be a cool little experiment. People have done it before, definitely, but like, I haven't tried it, so one day we'll do that. Because I think, right now, Raisin Cane's sauce is still better, right? But this is just as good. What the f- <laughs> 
That was the most Drake thing I've ever seen. Bro. What is he even slicing? Is he slicing the bread? Drake is an interesting lad. He's a very interesting creature. And he's got a butter knife too. That's insane though. I don't know if 2021 was when they started exploding, but point is, like they were on the come up. Drake was like, you know what? I like this. Invest. And he's not the first one according to that article. Uh, Samuel L. Jackson was one of the first people to invest, but someone as big as Drake, that's that's cool though. That's really cool. I don't know how many locations he's got. Bro, this is just a whole, like, Dave's Hot Chicken, like, <laughs> like, like, meat ride. 199? 199 locations. Well, boys, this is a prime lesson, and uh, dreams do come true. That's crazy. To start from equivalent to, like, a Filipino, like barbecue stand all the way to being as big as like i don't know i wouldn't say mcdonald's but like being as big as like raising canes all right never mind never mind raising canes is 700 locations never mind all i'm saying is that it's not gonna take long until dave's hot chicken gets there so it's cool i think it's really cool now that i mentioned raising canes which one do i like better this goes without saying i think dave's hot chicken is better however i still think the sauce from raising canes is better I, that's just me like this has the full package you know what i mean the only thing kind of like off is the is the sauce because i mentioned this before like no one really goes to raising canes for the chicken everyone talks about the sauce when it comes to raising canes it's it's for a good reason i think they're i think they're i think their sauce is the best sauce in the chicken industry but when it comes to the overall package of like the the chicken the color of the chicken like the, the flavor overall Dave's has it. The nice thing is too is that like the hype I guess has gone down a little bit so when I got to the store it wasn't as full. It does still get packed out during lunchtime though so take that as you will but I think for now this is too good. And these guys actually made me like coleslaw or is this I think this is kale slaw. Normally I don't I don't mess with kale or slaw at all but in this sandwich it's pretty good. Who would have thought that this actually was a good match? What am I doing? I haven't even opened a Dave's sauce yet. One bit that I do every time I go to Dave's Hot Chicken, I always try to haggle as many Dave's sauce from them as possible. So this time, I, I think I got, I think this is 10. This is 10. W in the chat. W in the chat. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> I haven't even tried their milkshakes yet. There's still a couple of things that I haven't tried. There's nothing else left to say. Thank you, Dave's Hot Chicken, for deciding to come to my town. I appreciate it. I, or no, no, what? I appreciate it. You guys are the goat for that one. So, either way, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Me just ranting about food. <laughs> Point is, uh, y'all have a good night. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Turn around. No, I got options. Begging me to go, but I tell her to stop it. Always got the key in my heart just to lock it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like a pro, but you're really a novice.